Hello everyone, welcome back to the Mom of Rick channel and here we talk about trends in the cryptocurrency space, we talk about what's going on, we talk about the news and we talk about the latest craziest thing. Now what I'm going to talk about today is not the latest craziest thing but it's a demonstration of some of these pictures that are trading for millions and millions of dollars and that's why the NFT space in the crypto space has brought what we refer to as mainstream adoption. So in today's video I'm going to show you this NFT that's completely knocking the price action out of the park. So if if you're interested in this kind of thing please don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and welcome to the mama brick channel so guys come first the first thing i want to do when you type board ape yach so this is what we're going to talk about today if you're new to the crypto space this is one of the most popular nfts you see out there actually when you type board ape i think that's the best thing to approach this you see board ape yacht club now i'm going to use this tool one of my favorite tools to navigate the crypto space to understand what is going on so when you open this particular nft before we get into the details guys i want to show you this right here volume 18.73 million dollars this is in 24 hours and this has been happening for a very long time and remember we're in the bear market okay so market capitalization in the bear market this has been happening for a long time 4.3 billion dollars how many traders only 73 traders legitimate people though floor price so each of these nfts 431 thousand dollars currently that's the cheapest one you can get or that's the cheapest price that was bought the last the cheapest nft was bought for this price that was the lowest price so 42 sales in the last 24 hours and the average price is $445,000, okay? So what am I talking about? Of course, I've already mentioned the name, but this is the Board Ape Yacht Club. These guys actually recently released a token, a coin, but we'll get into those details in a bit. Today's video is short, but I want to introduce to you some of these effects that, that can be created by the network effect and blockchain technology and if they're able to create this kind of effect then imagine the market capitalization the amount of money that will be flowing through these ecosystems infinite guys infinite and all kinds of value is going to be captured when you go to their website this is basically what you see you see a house with b a y c which is board aph club welcome to the board aph club and you basically are introduced to this a limited nft collection where the token itself doubles as your membership to a swamp club of apes the club is open um ape in with us so guys you have to remember when these tokens when these nfts were launched they were trading for 0 0.08 ethereum and at the time i think ethereum was trading for probably less than two thousand dollars or way less than it than it was at its highest price and this was an affordable price some people bought these at one thousand five hundred dollars which seemed like a lot but you've seen the prices the minimum prices here the floor prices of these nfts when you look at their current 24 hour volume in a bear market so if you want to see what they look like these are what they look like there were 10,000 initial nfts that were released at that price so this company um actually this was bought by yuga labs so these nfts are 10,000 of them and you and they are classified just like many nfts they're classified in terms of traits what traits do they have what clothes are they wearing do they have some jewelry this one has some kind of laser eyes on a party hat so you can also uh, sort of filter them according to those characteristics that they have like the background they have so that could fit into maybe a kind of aura maybe maybe not an aura but just a background the types of clothes they're wearing the types of eyes they have so these kinds of aesthetics can actually spike up their price depending on what the community is deciding just like how the community decided that these nfts that were launched at 0 0.08 but apparently this was at the beginning of this whole nft craze so some of the things that might have helped them was the fact that they did this model of releasing a bunch of nfts so not just something drawn by a an artist out there but i guess some of them are computer generated and they were of extremely high quality and it was the first sort of innovative product of its kind selling these nfts with the aim of creating utility for them so this formula there's no particular formula for launching a, sus a successful product but this formula one of a kind is is something that worked for them and it's being replicated by so many other companies out there in this nft space so if you look at their team there was just a, a four people basically gargamel gordon goner emperor tomato ketchup no sass so basically of course they don't use their names i think two of them or one of them were exposed but that's not the point of this video when you look at the roadmap they've apparently executed the whole thing 10 percent we pay back we we pay back our mums 20 percent we release the uh 
caged apes five and so on and then 100 percent the mutant ape so mutant apes are an evolution of those bored apes that you've just seen and we're going to take a look at them of course there's a bunch of bored apes some look like cheetahs or their, their skin color some have a golden skin color like different characteristics some have been bought by celebrities and all kinds of people some bought them for a low price and they were they, they've managed to generate life-changing wealth just by owning one of these things so this is what i'm alluding to the nft space is insane guys so this was an article i'm not going to read this article but basically this was talking about the airdrop token so these nfts board ape nfts here they came in different categories and each person that owned these different categories was liable to being airdrop these tokens of course these now of course on the website of the tokens you can log in and get in there but what i wanted to show you is these are the board apes you can view these on OpenSea, which was which is one of the best platforms to view nfts on so you can view all the nfts you can see there are 10,000 items, 6.4 thousand owners, 152 Ethereum floor price and traded volume 521 Ethereum. So that's a lot of money, guys. Then you can see here the Bored Ape Carnel Club. You can see their dogs here. They have a lower price. If you view through these NFTs, you can see their floor prices. For example, someone bed seven or is offering seven ethereum for this one and it's not being accepted the owner is not accepting it 20 ethereum for this one 50 ether those that know the prices of ethereum that's a lot of money so these other versions that were created that they like the kernel club or kernel club there's the mutant ape yacht club which are also slightly more expensive than the kernel club but there are a sort of a, a mutation of the board apes themselves and then there's also the board ape chemistry club so i guess the or board ape chemistry is it chemistry i think so so you can use some of these chemical vials to probably change the type of your to mutate your nft even more and i guess that's somehow how the uh bored apes can actually turn into mutant apes so you could use these vials to create other bored apes that can create more value for you so getting back into this article board api club just dropped an ape coin token to its nft holders some made tens of thousands of dollars if you look at the current price of this ape coin it's 20 dollars 20 dollars that's a, a huge huge spike and it wasn't even the highest price it reached it spiked to about 26 dollars then um of course it had to tra retrace back that price movement and at some point it was at 11 dollars but the point of this is that any individual that owned a board ape basically was dropped about 10,000 tokens just like you can see this user here was like i was basically lucky back then this person bought $1,700 for one ape they have a mutant ape or something like that but they were able to also uh, get this airdrop to participate in this airdrop get airdrop 10,000 tokens which they sold for 25 ethereum which is pretty much a bunch of money $72,000 and they were like i'm in shock i don't know what to do with this so my point is this uh, crypto space can truly, truly change lives and there's a lot of things that can happen. Right now we're in a bear market. Usually, the, usually these bear markets last for about two and a half or three years. But the reason why that's happening is because during the bear market, that's when companies are building, that's when people are building and that's where the best opportunities lie because at the end of this sort of one and a half, two year, two and a half year bear market uh, period, uh, at the end of it, you see massive innovation that comes out of this bear market sort of like a phoenix riding rising from its ashes and then these new products or these new findings these new discoveries within the crypto space lead to these kinds of innovations that can create life-changing opportunities for people so pay attention to the crypto space pay attention to the nft space and keep educating yourself by using amazing tools like this one actually i like this particular tool not a sponsored video but you can it can take you through most of the blockchains out there and what they're doing their rankings the activity out there so you see the most popular blockchains in terms of decentralized applications or smart contracts running on them so it's a very good tool to kind of analyze the space and you can also use it to analyze this is what i used to analyze the board apes of course there's many many other tools out there in the crypto space but this space is extremely fast expansive so you don't want to overwhelm yourself by just try to find out some of the uh, tools out there that are really good and reliable and familiarize yourself with them if new new tools come up then you'll have the knowledge and expertise to on easily onboard onto them so guys i hope you learned something i hope you took away something from this video these nfts space is not a joke and it's just getting started despite this company showing extreme absolute insane levels of success it's not the end of it there's so many new companies that are out there that are being built and it's all about how resilient you are at looking at this space and 
readying yourself for the opportunities that might emerge. Alright guys, I'll see you on the next one. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. Take care. Bye-bye.